Let's talk about this case for the Galaxy S7 Edge made by UAG. I've used some really nice cases with the Galaxy S7 Edge so far, but I think that this one has been my favorite so far. UAG has always done a really good job with their cases. It's a great case company that could be just a go-to. If you were to ask me about a case to be recommended for the Galaxy S7 Edge or any other phone that's supported by this company, I would say you can't go wrong with it. It's a nice rugged case, but it's nice and thin as well. It's going to protect from those drops and also those bumps and scrapes. So let's go ahead and get this installed so you can see what it looks like. First of all, it's really easy to install. Just start at the bottom or the top and just snap it on in and you're good to go. That's all there is to it. You know, I always like to kind of press the buttons forward just to make sure that they're in the right spots. And then there you go. It's all installed really easy. One of the questions you might have is if it interferes with the edge features at all, and it doesn't. Like I'm able to swipe just fine without any kind of interference. And it really works. It works great. Like you can activate it really simple and easy. I'm not putting much effort into it at all. Speaking of the edge, the case is not raised above the screen. That would defeat the purpose of the edge. But it is raised above down at the bottom and also the top. That's a really important factor because if the phone falls face down, it should actually hit this versus just flat on the screen. It's gonna help, you know, basically kind of make a bounce effect. I had actually dropped my phone and I had a case on it that was raised above like this and it saved it. So I know that it's very important to have a raised lip on the top and on the bottom of the phone. Speaking of the raised lip, you're gonna notice that the corners are actually reinforced really nicely. If the phone falls on the corner, it's going to be really protective and actually many drops happen on the corner. So you know you can rest assured that it's going to protect these corners, it's going to absorb that impact and save your phone. Being that the back and the front are made of glass, it's really important to have a protective case on this phone. As much as I like rocking this phone without a case, it's got an awesome premium feel to it. I just feel super nervous about the phone getting dropped and getting bumped and scraped up. So it's really important to me to have a case that's going to protect this phone so it keeps looking brand new and fresh. Other important factors about a case is if the button covers actually feel like they're tactile. I don't like them to be hard to press at all, and this case doesn't disappoint. It feels nice and tactile, there's no problem at all. The same feel goes for the volume controls, and actually, the volume controls feels a little bit better than the power button, but the power button doesn't feel bad. Another nice thing is that it's got this little texture here, so it's really easy to find if you're not looking at the phone itself. On the back, you get a nice cutout for your camera and also your LED light, along with your heart rate sensor and the sensor is just really easy to get to. You can hold your finger at either direction and it's not gonna interfere or make you smudge the camera lens at all. I like this kind of honeycomb design on the back and just kind of like the structure. It just looks really cool, but also it just adds like this nice grip to it. You're able to hold onto the phone without feeling like you're gonna drop it. Even on the back end with this being like a polycarbonate plastic, it feels really good. These little textures and these curves and stuff, they just add to the grip and it just adds to that ability to hold onto the phone securely. On the bottom you have cutouts for your headphone jack, your USB port, microphone, and speaker. It doesn't interfere with any of that kind of stuff. It fits every size that I've used, including some bigger heads for the headphone jack. Up at the top you get a microphone cutout and that pretty much does it for all the cutouts. Like I said, this case is definitely one of those highly recommended cases that you can get for any phone. It definitely fits well for the Galaxy 7 Edge. If you want to pick one up for yourself, I'll leave a link down below in the description. There's a few colors that you could choose from. Let me know what color you like the best in the comments down below. Be sure to share this video with Facebook, Twitter, and Google+. Hit that subscribe button so you don't miss any more Galaxy 7 Edge videos. And until then, stay techie.